I also was looking for a tutorial how to load SysX files into the TX802 and this is how you do it. First of all, you click on System Setup. Then you go here on Protect and turn that off. I already switched it to off. With here those buttons, plus and minus, you can switch it from on to off. Quite simple. So that's it. Then you need to move over again to System Preferences. You click on SysX, you select here Channel 1, and by pressing the button again, where, where system was, there you see voice data receive block. Select here 1 to 32 if you want to load old DX7 files. So again, when you click it here, so this channel is 1 and 1 to 32 here on system setup and SysX, and that's it. So now you can be anywhere where you like inside your TX802, doesn't matter, it will receive uh, the data. So what I did as a setup, um, I plugged in here in MIDI in, of course, MIDI in, I plugged in here to MIDI out, my MIDI interface, which in this case is a MIDI tech, but it can be any MIDI interface. So, and now I'm here inside in my Mac, and inside my Mac, I opened here Syst, SysX Librarian. That's a very tiny tool. You see this icon here. I will link it in the description later. And there you can um, uh, uh, send the files. So first of all, I need to switch to the MIDI um, port to receive it. In my case, it's MIDI port 1, where the TX802 is plugged in. And that's nearly it. What I also needed to do was here go to Preferences. And I set here the pause between uh, played messages to two seconds, because uh, otherwise it's too fast and the machine uh, will have problems. And tr the transmit, sp transmit speed, transmit speed, transmit speed, speed uh, can be set up here. And I set it here to about 11%. Maybe it will otherwise also work. But that's what I did. And this worked for me perfectly. Then you take your SysX file. I already um, drag and dropped already one SysX file in here. Um, okay. And then you click on play up here. And I will show you what happens. I click on play here and on the machine. It directly says MIDI bulk data now receiving. Look over here, it's sending as set. Make it slow that you get a success message which came here MIDI bulk data received. Yes, and that's the thing that you need to do to get sounds from the old TX7 to the TX802. If you liked it, please leave me a comment in uh, below and um, yeah. Have a great day and have fun and make music. Bye.